everyone doing? Okay, Baby Says Show. Um, the show is about to begin. Thanks for coming, guys. And uh, this show is about to begin uh, deliverance, um, you know, hindrances of deliverance. So, uh, you know, uh, oh, talking about deliverance, uh, I'm waiting for uh, try for for what Chinese delivery, <laughs> Chinese food. Okay, that's a good laugh. Chinese food. Uh, so I don't know how to speak Chinese well, but I look like uh, I I look like Chinese. You know, if you look at my eyes, uh, I really look like Chang 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 Ting Chang. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I look like. So talking about deliver hindrances of deliverance, right? And talking about hindrances of deliverance. Uh, there, uh, for me, there, there's no hindrances of deliverance. If you if you're willing to be delivered, you know, uh, put yourself in a box, you know, put yourself in a box, and wrap yourself, and um, you you then you will be you will be delivered. <laughs> <laughs> a gift wrap, you'll be delivered, you know. So uh, all you have to do is to uh, is to you're willing to be de you're willing to be delivered. So you know, <laughs> you have to have the willing to be delivered. You gotta put yourself in a box, you know, if, because if you're not willing, then you you're not going to be de delivered. Simple like that, you know. So. <laughs> <laughs> no, honestly, honestly, we're going to the show, but um, Jesus, uh, Jesus allow everybody to be delivered. Remember, uh, uh, like that, like that woman who had um, caught in the act of adultery, and he, he, he didn't say that you you gotta walk uh, back to back. You have to you have to go from uh, from east to south in order for for me to forgive you. No, he didn't say that. He didn't say to the woman to uh, he didn't say to the woman that uh, that kneel down and walk back and forth or uh, you have to bring me some um, some fig tree fig fig tree. <laughs> You have to bring me. You have to bring me some some some. Uh, what? You have to bring me some fix here in order for you to get delivered. He did not say that. <laughs> he just said. He just said, go and sin no more. So he was. She was just delivered just like that. Even the even the man with leprosy, and he said, uh, Lord, please heal me. If you're willing, Lord, please heal me. Remember that. A woman with leprosy, uh, and and, he, and Jesus said, um, "Are you willing?" That 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 that's the question. Is Jesus like Jesus is so so simple? Are are you, are you willing to to say yes to me? <laughs> it's just like his courting someone. Are you willing to say yes? I love you to me. Come on, come on, then I'll marry you. <laughs> He asked the he asked the leprosy man, "Are you willing to get healed?" And the leprosy man said, "Yes, Lord, I am willing." And immediately he healed. So I think the the only reason the only thing that I know the hindrance of del of of um, of deliverance is if you're not willing and if you do not believe, if you not believe. But. We have this uh, man of God here on the show, and let's have uh, we have this guest here on the show, and let's get into it. We have this guest, and let's go for a talk show. It's just a talk show, okay? A talk show, and uh, I think he's going to uh, pray for deliverance today. Come on, let's go, guys. Thanks for. Uh, it's not it's not a talk show, so we're 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 opening up the curtain and go inside the radio, right? Let's go, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, the award-winning five-star worldwide Christian radio talk show awarded by National Association of Broadcasters and a five-star awardee of Christian Music Parade, the arising Christian music artist, live from Radio Station World, here's the arising Christian radio host, Baby Siv.
There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. Believe in the power in the name of Jesus to break every chain, break every chain. Break every chain to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. In the power in the name of Jesus to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain, to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. There's an army.
All right. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, America. Good afternoon, America. Welcome to Baby Club World Christian Talk Show. We're live here on Radio World, Radio World, and uh, all the way down from uh, it's New York City, who is the main, the base of the radio, radio, and it was uh, 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 <laughs> affordable, uh, given by uh, from the Washington D.C. National Association of Broadcasters. Um, in the United States. So good evening, and I guess I have some guests here uh, on 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 the air right now. I can see. Uh, I think Sister Mary Lou, are you on the air? Sister Mary Lou. I'm here. How are you doing? <laughs> Hallelujah, Miss Sister Mary Lou on the air. I think Sister April. Sister April. April, are you on the air? Sister April. Sister April, are you there? Is that you? Who's on two eight one? Hallelujah. Sister April, are you in the air? I'm not sure if that's Sister April or not. Uh, speak, speak to yourself. But before we go on, I would like to I would like to uh, thank our sponsor, acknowledge our sponsor of the show. The show is not gonna go on without our sponsor of the show. Let's have uh, Self Jewelry. Thanks for sponsoring the show. Planet Fitness. Thank you for sponsoring the show. And uh, Planet Fitness, we have all the zones. They they are all less than a year. <laughs> Wendy's Hamburger, thanks for sponsoring this show. ADT Security Alarm System, they uh, specialize in burglary and and uh, 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 burglary and 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 uh, flood. Uh, what they, what what they, I don't have that uh, thing that they gave it to me. But ADT Security Alarm System, thank you for sponsoring the show. Dish Network, thank you for sponsoring the show. And of course, uh, Senior Life Insurance been six months plus. Bell Taco been um, been like two months. Sonic. Bell Taco is three months, I'm sorry. Yes, Bell Taco is three months. And Sonic is one and a half months. One and a half months. And of course, my endorser, WW, go to alwaysnessflowers.com, 1-888-720-8221, 1-888-720-8221, 7 And you mentioned Baby Step Show, that you get 40% discount on delivery of the flower. If you want to be a, a sponsor of Baby Step Show, write me to Baby Step Show, P.O. Box 40921, Bakersfield, California. Again, Baby Step Show, P.O. Box. 4091 Bakersfield, California. And here we go. Uh, looking at the, the stats right now, we have a very large, large audience. It's a large audience right now. I can see it right now. Canada. Canada, 20%. Hallelujah. South, South, North, uh, South Africa, North Africa, and, and um, Central Africa is 15.5%. How about that? Our France, Argentina, Italy, 15% listening, 15%. Good idea. It's, it's Spain, Sweden, 10%. It's right here. Singapore, 17% listening. Madagascar, Madagascar, 12%. Singapore, Germany, London, 15% listeners. United Kingdom, 20% listeners. My goodness. Brazil, 10.7% listening. Australia, Australia, 20% listening. Utopia, 10% listening. Utopia, and of course, we have we have Ukraine right here, 10% listening. I like to say Ukraine. India, 15% listening. Bolivia, 10% listening. Singapore, 20% listening. Philippines, 22% listeners. Finland, 10% listeners. I said that Sweden is right there. Sweden, the same thing. And I said Madagascar. But here in Ghana, Zimbabwe, Cameroon, Nigeria, they are all 15.5% listeners. All right. And also India. I mentioned India already, 15%. 15% listeners. They're my regular listeners, India. And of course, United States of America is 89.7%. How about a shout out? Yes. 89.7%. United States of America. Today is a special show up here. I think I think I mentioned you, Sister April. Are you on the air? Sister April, are you on the air? Yes, I'm back. Okay. Welcome it to the show. It took me a while. I don't know what happened. 
Mm-hmm. Thank you, you for all your prayers. Mm-hmm. I'm here to say. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. And of course, Sister Mary Lou, do you wanna do you wanna greet the audience? Sister Mary Lou? Welcome to everybody from Tampa, Florida, where it's not yeah. nice and there's a thunderstorm here, but it's okay. The sun is shining. Oh, it's a thunderstorm. How, 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 was, how, <laughs> how was the wedding on San Diego? The wedding how was, was wedding? wonderful. Mm-hmm. Oh, the, the, the two lovers, they love the Lord, so they just put all their trust and their uh-huh. strength in the Lord to make their, their marriage grow. Oh, that's wonderful! That's wonderful. I no, I'm yes. sorry, I wasn't able to make it. I get caught up with many things now up here around me. But that's today right. we have a very special guest, guys. Our special guest today. I would like to. Uh, I would like also to acknowledge um, uh, Evangelist Jacqueline. Uh, there, uh, uh, you know, I, I, I condolence to your family, Evangelist. Evangelist. She's not gonna make it because of preparing funeral service for uh, for uh, dead loved ones. Uh, sorry for your loss. And also, uh, brother Doyle um, uh, is uh, asking. Uh, she, he's coming here like regular too on the show, but you know uh, he's recovering from sickness. So here we are. But today we have a very special guest. Our special guest today. Uh, this is the second time that he's coming back. He is. Uh, he is known for his. He's a minister. He, he's a minister. He's known for his ministry of deliverance. De- deliverance. And he's here today to talk about hindrances of deliverance and and also to to pray for deliverance because the last time he prayed there are about two or three people who testify that they were that, that they were delivered delivered yes thank you jesus so without further ado i would like to you guys to welcome Minister Brian C.P. Malave is on the air, guys. It's, it's on Baby Sub Worldwide talk show. How about how about the how about the hand, Minister Brian uh, C.P. Malave? Amen. <laughs> amen. 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 In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Yes. How I'll are you, Minister? Yes. Right. How are you, Minister Brian? How how are you doing? How's I'm doing everything? well. You know, making everything is going well. Making it by the grace of God. Every day is a new day for me, and we always got a new surprise. And I'm, yes, I'm happy yes. to be loved. Amen. Yes. Uh, you see, every single day he's being used by God to uh, to deliver. Uh, to, 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 he's being used by God to be deli- He's a vessel being used by God to to deliver the lot who are uh, people who are in bondage, those who are uh, possessed by the by by our enemy. And uh, we are very honored for him to be here because he he made it he made it to the show. Hallelujah. So. Uh, Amen. Yes. And I'm here to I'm, I'm here to let everyone know, Luke mm-hmm. chapter ten verse nineteen. Mm-hmm. I, I want you to Lord, I want you to know what the Lord said. I have mm-hmm. given you authority to trample yes. on snakes and scorpions, and to overcome all power of the enemy. Nothing mm-hmm. will harm you. You mm-hmm. need everyone needs to stand and believe that in Jesus mm-hmm. Christ's money that you could trample on snakes and scorpions. You are given the authority to do that. And it's just mm-hmm. that not many not believing it. Mm-hmm. Amen. Mm-hmm. So, go ahead. Amen. Go ahead, yes. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Uh, so uh, we're gonna talk about these hindrances of uh, of deliverance. But but any event, uh, brother Brian. So every single day, I look at your uh, I look at the the testimony of people, the people who are being delivered from drugs, from alcohol, from sicknesses mm-hmm. from any kind of oppression, depression. Uh, what a mighty God we serve, you know? You're being used by God. It's, a, it's, it's the anointing that you have, you know, what a mighty God we serve. If I'm not mistaken, there were three people who testified the last time you were here about the, uh, about your prayer. Wow. So, yes. Yeah, so, uh, 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 so what's going on with your ministry? Do you have any activities before we go on that you want to uh, uh, tell to, to the audience? Uh, well, yes, actually, and um, well, you know what? I I should have in, in New Jersey, in America, in June fifth, 
mm-hmm. at, at, at um at a hotel in the Holiday Inn, Jersey. I'll I'll give mm-hmm. the. I'm sorry, I don't even have the address where it's at. Mm-hmm. Well, pe- yes. at June fifth, anyone is more than welcome to come visit me, and I will lay hands on them for their freedom in Jesus Christ's mighty name. I have that coming up in June fifth. I'll, mm-hmm. I'll have the address up at the end of the show. Okay. But, um, yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Yeah, sure. Amen. Yeah. And anyone, I, and anyone, um, I am very accessible. If anyone mm-hmm. that wants to get in contact with me, they can email mm-hmm. me, they could call me, whatever it is, and I will respond back. And I could pray for anyone over the phone, over video. Mm-hmm. It doesn't and matter. Okay. Distance, right. Distance is no trouble from the whole, from, from from the power of the Holy yes. Spirit. Amen. 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 Uh, do you want to disclose your email address and your website? For, for everyone to hear it. Okay, anyone, if anyone needs deliverance, you could email me at cp. dot christ passion mm-hmm. at mm-hmm. gmail. dot com. Mm-hmm. So anyone you needs to... help, just email me, and I'll and I'll definitely answer back as soon as I can. Uh, you, you can repeat that, Brother Brian, because I know there are audience viewing. Right now, it's 89.7% of America, so you, know, uh, you can repeat your, your email again, if you can, please. Thank you so okay. much. Okay. C-P dot Christ, mm-hmm. C-H-R-I-S-T, passion, P-A-S-S-I-O-N, at mm-hmm. gmail.com. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Okay, so before we go on to, to, to these hindrances of deliverance, okay, uh, did you ever have issue before? I, I want to just ask now, Sister Mary Lou, Please. did you ever have issue with your family before any of your son or maybe yourself or maybe your husband or any member of the family who, uh, who got problem about uh, uh, issues in life and has been delivered by God? I mean, you know, uh, the, the best testimony is the real testimony in life. You know what I mean? Uh, like me, I got delivered. I got delivered from uh, from kind of a bondage. Uh, but I was I was in the world before, but I was delivered by God. You know, that, like me, I, I got delivered. Yeah. So, do you have any any experience, Sister Mary Lou? Before we go to you, Minister Brian. <laughs> yes, um, I had some rebelliousness in me growing mm-hmm. up, um, mm-hmm. even though, yes, even though I grew up in a very religious family, you know, we were mm-hmm. told what to do. There was a, uh, a rule, you know, uh, from the mm-hmm. catechism that we had to obey everything. But on the side, my family didn't know that mm-hmm. I was doing things that are not acceptable in the sight of God and mm-hmm. man. And for that reason... Uh, I have to be separated from the family. <clears throat> mm. They they have mm. to hide me because I became pregnant. It was a oh. uh, child out of wedlock. So mm-hmm. that was the, the thing that I have learned seriously in my life, that uh, mm. I don't want to be separated from my family. They have to hide me because of shame from the family because mm-hmm. I was pregnant. Uh, mm-hmm. and, and so I realized that in order to, for me to walk uprightly, I have to walk in the light. And that Amen. was the beginning of my walk and my search for truth. And mm-hmm. it came to the point where I had to get out of my so-called religion in mm-hmm. order to find the truth. And when mm-hmm. I found the truth and I was uh, uh, walking in the light, my friends left me. But that was for good because they did not realize that. Your friend left you? They left us. Uh-huh. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Before they they left because I had a child out of wedlock. Everybody was judging me. But yes. when I found the truth, I found the judgment from God mm-hmm. Himself that mm-hmm. I have to walk uprightly and I have to walk in the light, and I will never be ashamed again. Amen. 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 Okay, so, Amen. Uh, Okay, so we have a, a Minister Brian right here. If you have any question as we go on to the show, just feel free to ask a question. Let me ask before before we go on, Minister Brian, when did you know that you have that calling of the, uh, doing deliverance? Um, you have that? Yeah. When I, I was, mm-hmm. all right, when, when I was in prison, I, I, I used to be a drug mm-hmm. dealer. I uh-huh. got locked up. But mm-hmm. I always had the love of God in me. So when mm-hmm. I was in prison, 
I used to hear people cry at night. Oh. And um, what I used to do, I used to minister. I used to minister to them. I used mm-hmm. I used to go up to their cell and encourage mm-hmm. them and tell mm-hmm. them about Jesus. And I mm-hmm. used to offer prayers. Mm-hmm. So when I was laying when I was laying hands on people, mm-hmm. I used to see people like I used to see, I used to see people like was they was like in shock. They were like they, were, uh-huh. they almost like fell. They were like they was like whoa whoa what you doing? And I said I don't uh-huh. know. He said yo. <laughs> it was like I I felt something. I feel I feel better. I don't know what it is. So I didn't realize. <laughs> I, didn't realize I, I didn't realize about the power uh-huh. that I had because I was uh-huh. I was still learning. I, I uh-huh. was praying people because I, I felt sorry for them. Uh-huh. But as I, but as I, by years passed by, as I read more scriptures, then I started realizing that I had the power of the Holy Spirit within me. So I pursued mm-hmm. it even more. And then, mm-hmm. long story short, I, I became a, I became a minister of God and um helped set mm-hmm. the captives free in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. Amen. Oh, so yeah, amen. amen. So. Uh, uh, let, let's go to the topic right away. What What do you think? I have some um, comments on the screen here on my on my screen. So many people are writing up right now on my screen. But before we go, what do you think are the hindrances of deliverance, uh, Minister Bryant? Fear. Fear. Doubt. Oh, doubt. People are afraid. People are afraid to come against devils. They are afraid. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. fear causes confusion. Then confusion mm-hmm. causes doubt. Mm-hmm. So how do you overcome fear? People mm-hmm. need to understand the authority that is given to them. They need to mm-hmm. understand that the God that we serve is greater than the devil, is greater than Satan. And mm-hmm. if you believe what what if you believe what Jesus Christ taught us, then mm-hmm. you then the fear will be eliminated. And yes. fear, is, fear is a fear is a hindrance. Mm-hmm. We need to overcome fear first. Go, yes. Go ahead, go ahead, sister. Fear hind- What? What? How do you? How do? You, what do you think? How they can overcome fear? How do we overcome fear? Well, uh, so, so that deliverance will flow. How we overcome fear? Well, how you, these are steps that you want to overcome fear. You definitely mm-hmm. want to fellowship with the right people. You want to mm-hmm. fellowship. With the people who believe in the power of the Holy Spirit, we Amen. we need to stay. Yes, we need to stay Amen. away from lukewarm churches. Mm-hmm. Amen. Yes. Too yes. many churches out there. Mm-hmm. Too many churches out there ain't preaching the power of the Holy Spirit. Ain't preaching mm-hmm. the authority that. They preach the authority that was given to us. Let me read mm-hmm. John chapter 14, verse 14. So, mm-hmm. Verse 11 to 14. Let me get there real quick. Hold on. So mm-hmm. I'm going to read you John chapter 14, verses 11 to 14. Uh-huh. This is Jesus talking. Yes. <laughs> Believe me that I mm-hmm. am in the Father and the yes. Father in me. Yes. Or else believe me for the very work's sake. Verily, verily, I say on verily, verily, I say unto you, he that believes on me, the works that I do, shall yes. shall you do also, and greater yes. the works than this shall be due, because I go to my Father. Now, clearly, Jesus said, ask anything in His name, and He will tell and. In his, in his name, and he will tell the Father, the Father will know, and it will be granted. You, everyone needs to start asking for righteous things. Amen? Mm-hmm. Amen, amen, amen. He, amen. Already, knows your, he, mm-hmm. al- he already knows you. He already knows your wants. But if you start mm-hmm. asking, Father God, increase my wisdom. Father God, increase my love. Father God, mm-hmm. increase my fear. Father God, mm-hmm. help me read more Bibles. Those uh-huh. are righteous things. Yeah. He will gladly give that. Amen. Did, did you say something? Yeah. Did, more. did you say something like increase increase my fear? <laughs> did, <laughs> did you say what's it, increase my fear or what do you mean by that, uh, Minister Brian? No, no, no. 
as for the God to no to remove your fear. To, to increase remove your the fear. Okay. Yes, remove yes. the fear, not yes. increase. Yes. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. No, no, no. To, okay. to remove the fear and increase your wisdom and increase mm-hmm. the Holy Spirit within you. But how Amen. are we going to do that? Amen. Now, how are we going to do that? Mm-hmm. Hey, there's a lot of lazy people out there. There's a uh-huh. lot of lazy Christians. Uh-huh. They don't want to read the word of God. But guess what? Uh-oh. The devils. Mm-hmm. The devils are the blockers. It's the devil that try to try to make people get tired. Sometimes people mm-hmm. read the Bible and they fall asleep. Sometimes they can't mm-hmm. pay attention. So mm-hmm. we must pray. It's best yes. that everyone everyone prays before mm-hmm. you read the Bible. Ask yeah, Father man. God, please, please remove every distraction. Yes. So I could so, I, so my wisdom can increase. Yes. And like I yes. said again, fellowship with the right people. Fellowship with the right ministry. Find the Hallelujah. church that moves in the power of the Holy Spirit. Now Hallelujah. you gotta be careful. Mm-hmm. There's a lot of churches out there. Mm-hmm. That, there's a lot of churches out there moving in mm-hmm. witchcraft, pretending to be Christian. So mm-hmm. you gotta be careful with those churches that mm-hmm. that uses healing crystals. You wanna mm-hmm. avoid churches that has statues in them. Amen. Yes. You stay Amen. Away Amen. From <laughs> yes. Stay away from churches that have idols that pray to mm-hmm. saints. Amen. Yes. Those yes. are yes. stumbling blocks. Those Amen. are hindrances that people have to let go. Let it go. Yes. Okay, so at, at any event, uh, you mentioned about uh, about when they read the Bible or pray, uh, they can't they can't hear it, and a, a lot of them are are, are sleepy. <laughs> I, I was guilty. I was guilty by them. Yes. I don't. I don't have no enthusiasm of reading the Bible. I I feel sleepy if I read if I read my Bible before, you know, until I find out who he is. Uh, yes, I, I, I was. Uh, what about you, Sister April? Did you ever feel that uh, kind of um, you know you feeling sleepy <laughs> when the pastor is preaching? When the pastor is preaching, you feel sleepy. When you're reading your Bible, you feel sleepy. <laughs> Sister April. Did you have that kind of feeling yeah. before? Uh huh. When? When? I mean, I mean, when? <laughs> when? That is all just laughing. What? When? I. Did you hear what my, my what I said, Sister April? I'll go back no. to Sister Marilou. Sister Marilou, did so you please. ever feel that? Yeah, you yeah. know, this is the reason why. If we are not properly rested, we could fall asleep. But that's yes. the reason why we need to be awake. We need to prepare ourselves. When we are reading the Word of God, we really need to mm-hmm. pray like what the pastor said. Because mm-hmm. the whole the spirit, uh, the, 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 the bad spirit does not want us to know the truth. The bad spirit mm-hmm. does not want us to be awake. And for yes. this reason, our eyes are always fixed on, on yes. things because so that we... Yes. When when we are in the presence of God, there is no more energy. Yes, I, I have a question, um, uh, Minister Brian. Why is it this? This yes. is my experience. Why is it that every time a pastor is is doing a sermon, you feel like you it's a lullaby? You want to go sleep. <laughs> I look around my church. It's like about. What's that? It's, it's, I'm going to tell you why, and it's kind of sad too, because a lot of yes. times there's a lot of there's a lot of pastors out there that yeah. don't have no fire in them. Mhm, mhm, mhm. There's not enough fire. They're too mm-hmm. lukewarm. They need to. Uh-huh. They need. They, they need to be. They need. They need to move in the power of the Holy Ghost. Uh-huh, uh-huh. If you're reading, if, if you're preaching, if you're reading it just like this book, and there's no fire uh-huh. in it, you're gonna put the. Mm-hmm. You're going to put the sheep to sleep. Okay. You gotta know what you're okay. talking about. You gotta, you gotta, uh-huh. you you have to have the love uh-huh. for it. 
You got to love the people. You got to love yes. setting the captives free. You got to yes. you got to have you have to have the same ab- ambition, the same love the Father has that, that Jesus yes. has. Even though they yes. love more than us, but we all got to be in the same mission. Amen. Amen. A lot of pastors. <laughs> yes. Uh, and uh, unfortunately, unfortunately, there's a lot of pastors out there that's uh-huh. in it. For the wrong reasons, mm-hmm. a lot of reasons is there. Uh-huh. They in yes. it for the they in it for the money. They in uh-huh. it for the fame. They yes. in it for your tithing. So and their then, heart is in the wrong spot. Yes, their heart so is in you, the wrong spot. Yes. Yeah. So you hear that, Pastor? You got you got you got to shake the congregation. Shake it. You gotta be on fire. You know. Yes. So, yes. Do you agree with that, Sister Mary Lou? Sister Mary Lou. Yes. Sister, do you agree with that? That the pastor should be on fire so you can you can stay awake during the sermon. <laughs> how, that is, that is, how can somebody be asleep on when one is on fire? That just does not work together, <laughs> right? <laughs> when, <laughs> when the person, okay, yes. when there's yes. fire in the house, everyone will mm-hmm. run, will run, and everybody will be awake, and the fire of yes. God is consuming fire. Uh, yeah. So when we are consumed by the power of the Holy Spirit, it will uh-huh. naturally wake us up. You know, yeah. it doesn't really matter how tired we are. If we are uh-huh. filled with the Holy Ghost, we will be activated by a powerful supernatural force. Uh huh. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> nice there. That's a nice one. How about you, Sister April? Sister April, did you ever feel sleepy during sermon time? Sister April, are you still there? Sister April, are you still there? I'll come back to you when you're ready. Maybe she fell asleep. I don't know. She she <laughs> fell asleep. Oh no! Don't don't fall asleep right now. <laughs> Sister oh, April, no. you gotta wake up. You know? let, let, so, let me send some fire in her. Fire, fire, uh, fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, oh, no, maybe she's not a She can't get it up. Sister <laughs> April, are you still there, Sister April? I'll come back to you in a few. Uh, Oh, yeah, in the name of Jesus, maybe maybe she's doing something. But you know, uh, we'll go back to this. I have some uh, some um, this thing from the people around the world. Let's go to Bayonne, New Jersey. His name is Mer- her name is Mary. He said, "My church had prayed for me over uh, over my over, over delivered uh, over over the drugs. My church had prayed for me over over from drugs." I was delivered and I did not pray for two weeks. But after two weeks, I can't help but to take cocaine again. For me, it suits me if I have cocaine. And if I take it again, uh, I, it, it bothers me because I am hallucinating things and it's creating fear in me. How, how come my, my, my church prayed for me and it didn't work? Brother Brian, this question well, is for you. Mm. You didn't work, sister. You're not trying hard enough. Uh huh. Uh, now, now mm-hmm. deliverance—it's a process. Some right. people get deliverance fast. Some mm-hmm. others it takes time. So mm-hmm. we have to be patient. So uh-huh. we have to we have to renew the mind. We have uh-huh, to renew uh-huh. how you think. Yeah. We need to um. You need to, you need, first and foremost, you have to read more scriptures. Uh-huh. It's uh-huh. very important that you read the scriptures. When you read more scriptures, you, the, the Holy Spirit will increase inside of you. Uh-huh. Then you have to, um, then you have to, um, hold on, pardon me, for, let me just open up my notes real quick. Right. We just, I, I'm, I'm glad that she acknowledged that she, ha- mm-hmm. that she has an addiction problem. Yes. But, Mm-hmm. But then again, she mm-hmm. has to try mm-hmm. to fast. She has to try to fast as well. Uh huh. And, mm-hmm. and sometimes fast. it's not easy mm-hmm. to fast. So sometimes, so I, so I suggest, mm-hmm. I suggest that she fast for at least one day. Like she, okay. could, she could drink water, but mm-hmm. but have no, but eat no food. Don't eat no solids. 
Uh-huh. And um, stay in stay in the Word of God while you fast at the same time. Mm-hmm. And um, yes. and don't give and and don't give up just because uh-huh. someone is praying for you and, and you didn't receive no deliverance yet. A lot of mm-hmm. people give up and a lot, and uh-huh. they believe the lies of the the lies of the enemy that there's no hope. You gotta mm-hmm. seek victory, even mm-hmm. even when you when you chained up and you shackled mm-hmm. in chains. You gotta seek mm-hmm. victory over your life because Amen. the tongue mm-hmm. the the tongue can speak life or death. Yes. If you speak yes. death over your life, that will happen. But if you mm-hmm. speak victory, even before you even have yes. it, even mm-hmm. even you didn't get delivered yet, you tell Father God, I I will receive it. I am blessed. I am cured. I am delivered. Yes. You keep speaking life. That will stop breaking change. Mm-hmm. Yes. Amen. So watch. Yes. Amen. So watch what you speak on yourself. Amen. Yeah, right. so th- because she said that she got delivered for only two weeks. Then after two weeks, she craved for uh, for uh, drugs again. That's what she said here. And the, uh, the she- reason why the re- hold on the reason why that it came back because she slept. She got lazy. She, she got. She should have kept on. She should. She should have kept on being on fire. She she got lazy. That's no. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah. A lot of people get lazy, yes. Yes. The minute, what, what, what happened is this. People get delivered, then they uh-huh. get comfortable. Then all of, a, uh-huh. all of a sudden, they're not reading the Bible no more. They're reading it uh-huh. less, less, and less. Then uh-huh. temptation comes back in again. Yeah. And then yeah. you got to start the process all over again. So uh-huh. once you uh-huh. on fire, stay uh-huh. on fire. Amen? Stay, stay on fire. <laughs> yeah, stay on fire. Don't give up. Mm-hmm. Keep on the, keep keep on keep on reading the word like your life depends on it, and it does. Yes, Amen. yes. Amen. Yes. Mm-hmm. It's, it's, it's mm-hmm. on fire. It's stay on fire, guys. I mean, I'm not not. He's not saying uh, hell, but it's stay on fire means like uh, the fire of the Holy Ghost. That's what he meant, okay? The fire of the Holy Ghost, you know, like reading the Bible, praying. That's what he said. So uh, uh, we have here. Uh, the, uh, Sister Marilyn has a ministry about the homeless people and everything. I, I want to ask you something, Sister Marilyn. Do you notice some of the people who are homeless there uh, are bound to drugs also? Are they bound to drugs? Yes. Um, mm-hmm. y- yes. Um, most How of they the react? time. They, uh-huh. resort, they resort to drugs, drugs and alcohol because of their physical condition. For example, uh, they have no home, of course. I mean, mm-hmm. they, they try to drown themselves from, mm-hmm. from living a, 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 like a, in a fantasy land. You know, after a mm-hmm. while, they fall asleep mm-hmm. because they, they, alcohol will make you fall asleep. That's what Satan does, you know. Instead mm-hmm. of being mm-hmm. awake and, like the pastor said, acknowledge your sin. You know, yes, and, and yes. there's a point to all of uh, connecting them to the to godly people, and, yes. and then once they're connected to godly people, then they start to see the light. Then they start, and gradually, slowly but surely, by the power of the Holy Spirit, they're able to overcome the lust of the flesh because uh-huh. the power of God has come upon them, and it is possible Amen. for the Amen. people to be renewed and transformed. It is possible yes. if they, yes. as the pastor yes. said, if they will acknowledge and if they will yearn, yearn to be delivered. They have to yearn yes. and say, I, I need to get rid of this old man um, to let go because the flesh cannot crucify mm-hmm. itself. You know, yes. the, the flesh cannot put off itself. And also the flesh cannot, cannot recall itself dead. So one yes. has to die to, to the past in order to let the resurrection power of Christ renew their life and be transformed yes. and renewed. And it is possible with time. Yes. I have a question to Minister Brian. Uh, okay, is it possible, Minister Brian, to pray for someone who is uh, like alcoholic or drugs, but then... Um, you pray for them, but then they still want it. You don't see changes. How does that happen? You pray for it. You know, you, like let's say you're a minister, you pray for them, but it didn't. It didn't happen because they still want to be in that in that in that kind of situation. So, 
So, now, there's a difference between someone addicted that's seeking help and there's mm-hmm. a difference when someone doesn't want help. Mm-hmm. I, can't, I cannot help someone who's still hugging their demons. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. If you're still hugging your demons, you're still loving your demons, I can't do nothing. Now, mm-hmm. if the person's in bondage and the person mm-hmm. says, I need help, there's got to mm-hmm. be a way out. I need you mm-hmm. to help me. Those mm-hmm. people can get freedom. And when they mm-hmm. get freedom, then I'm able to give them instructions how to maintain their freedom, yes. how to maintain yes. their deliverance. Stay yes. connected with a pastor like me. Or, mm-hmm. or they could sign a ministry that's around them that moves in the power of yes. the Holy Spirit. Amen? Yes. Yes. We, we got to stay mm-hmm. where we need to stay where yes. the fire is at. Yes, we stay where the stay where the fire is. At. It is. It stay where it is. You know, it stay where it is. So, um, and and also, God, God is not a God of force. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. God is not a God of force. You know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You have to be willing to be delivered. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, we have yeah. here Georgia, Georgia Jennifer. She said, "Please pray for my father for his deliverance of alcohol." Alcoholism. Alco- he's he's alcoholic. His name is Anthony Pearson. Okay, you got that, yeah. br- brother Brian? Uh, Minister Brian, did yeah. you get that? Uh, yeah. His name is Anthony yeah. Pearson. She's asking for uh for 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 our deliverance for alcoholism to her father. Her name is Jennifer, and the name of the father is Anthony Pearson. Georgia, uh, Georgia Jennifer. Thank you. Florida, this uh, time. Uh, Give me 15 seconds because I want to be in agreement right now. All right? Yes. Give me 15 seconds. Yes. Father God, I pray for Anthony right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I pray that he has an ear to hear. Give yes. him revelation. Yes. Give yes. him conviction, Father God. I yes. pray that you put your Holy Ghost fire upon him right now in the yes. mighty name of Jesus Christ. And we break those chains right now yes. in Jesus Christ. Mighty name. Thank you, yes, everybody, but we are in agreement. I am Hallelujah. in agreement with Jennifer yes. that those chains will be broken yes. in your son. Jesus' yes. name. Amen. 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 Yes. Um, we have now from mm-hmm. Florida. That was uh, that was uh, that was a really powerful prayer. Come on, guys! About the shout out for that, Anthony Pearson. Yes. We declare you yes. you are yes. delivered. We declare yes. you are delivered, yes. Anthony yes. Pearson. You know. May I, may I say something it. real quick? May I say something real quick? Hello? Yes. Yes. We, Go ahead. Everyone must under. Everyone must understand. We must confess to each other. We must yes. come into an agreement. Because when yes. two or more are in agreement, then yes. change can be broken. So if you need Amen. prayer, don't be ashamed to ask yes. someone else, hey, come in agreement with me yes. in Jesus' yes. name. Yes. And it will be done. Amen? Yes. Amen. Amen. Okay, we have you from Florida, Annie. You're from Florida, right, Sister Mary Lou? You, are you from Florida? Yes, I'm from Tampa, Florida. Okay. Uh, Annie, she said, we, the body of Christ, must be delivered also from the vision to, to, other, to other Christians. We, the because of pride and debates the regarding about differences of doctrine when when <clears throat> one of my one of my sister has blocked me on social media and unfriend me uh we disagree on one thing the body of Christ must be delivered also o- also uh, let minister Brian answer that question yes, yes. One of, Let me one of before the, you one answer, of, yeah, Mr. Brian. Before you answer, be, would you okay? Uh, let me ask Mr. Marilu. Would you block somebody who 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 is not in in the same doctrine as you are, Sister Marilu? Because he said some. Um, he said her girlfriend, my sister in Christ. She said that she blocked me on social media or unfriend me because of differences. Uh, okay, um, <clears throat> that's a very good question because Jesus did not block 
those that were coming to him, the mm-hmm. people that were coming to him were full of iniquities. And Jesus mm-hmm. also did not block even the Pharisees. Mm-hmm. And he knows the Pharisees and Sadducees were full of pride. In fact, yes. they were the one who crucified him, right? Uh-huh, so, uh-huh. Yes. Um, Jesus, Jesus actually, what Jesus said is forgive them for they do not know what they are doing. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, okay. Sister, yes. Sister April is back. Sister April, uh, did you ever block someone in your, in your... I welcome back. I don't know what happened to you. Are you okay there? Are you okay there, Sister April? Can you hear me? Yes. Wow. Can yes. you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. Welcome back to the show. I'll come back to you. Okay, I'll go back to Mr. Brian for a minute. Mr. Brian, is it okay to, to block... Uh, anyone that that is not in the same doctrine as you are, as as we are, or as w- whatever. But it says here, Florida Annie said that we the body of Christ must be delivered. Would you agree with that, Minister Brian? No. Mm-hmm. Now, if I'm preaching the word of God, and if that person exited from me, then mm-hmm. that's their problem. At mm-hmm, the end mm-hmm. of the day. When the when Jesus Christ went from when he went to a town mm-hmm. and when they rejected him, what mm-hmm. did he do? He turned he around, mm-hmm. kicked the dust off his feet, and he mm-hmm. kept moving. Amen. 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 Now, mm-hmm. if, now, if you if you're preaching good doctrine and the, mm-hmm. and the people reject it, maybe mm-hmm. the Lord removed that person from you because he the Lord knows. That person was going to be a stumbling block against you. Amen. Amen. That makes yes, that's the true. Lord, mm-hmm. The Lord, the Lord will remove toxic people that's going to hurt you and your ministry. Mm-hmm. God will remove toxic people. <laughs> yeah. Okay. There will be a hindrance to, to, to your ministry. I believe that. Yes. Amen. There was a, 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 yeah. anything else. Uh, let's go back to April. April, um, yeah. did you ever have a misunderstanding or, 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 or argument to uh, to any the brother or sister in the Lord? Sister April. Wait, sister April. Sister, yeah. um, anything? <laughs> did you ever have encounter any mm-hmm. conflicts from from brother or sister in the Lord? Uh, no, not that I can recall. Yes. I know, you, you are a friend, you are a friend to everybody. <laughs> she's a friend to everybody, you know? Yeah. Yeah, she's, yeah. yes. Very good, very yeah. good. Let I'll hold the hand. Me, Go ahead, no, brother. Let me, let, me add, let, me, let me add to this. Let me yes. add to this. Now. Yes. If there's if there's someone that mm-hmm. that's very toxic to the mm-hmm. ministry, and if that person, if, and mm-hmm. if I knew that person causing a lot of trouble, yes, mm-hmm. we must rebuke that person and hand them over to Satan. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, it's mm-hmm. difficult when when people be, when <laughs> when people became a hindrance mm-hmm. and became a hindrance, they they, yes. they put them out of the ministry. And uh-huh. hand them over to Satan in hoping that will repent and they will come back. Amen. 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 Sometimes yes. you gotta sometimes a lot of times you gotta cut off and let them go. And if they yes. come back, hallelujah. You want to go. If not, just, yes. just pray for them yes. and put them in the Lord's right. put them in the yes. Lord's hands. That's right. Yes. But also I wanna add That's to right. that we still we still gonna love them because the Bible said, let, let brother, brotherly love continue. <laughs> Why did you give up this love? Let brotherly love continue or sisterly love continue. Am I right? That's what it says also in the Bible. Yeah. Yeah. And you said well, you're yeah. going to pray for them. That's right. Lo- lo- love, your, love your enemy, but don't let love. one one, one dead egg spoil, spoil the batch. Yes. A little, a little leave it. Yes. A little leave it. Yes. So we got to yes. follow that one person. To yes. protect the whole, to protect everyone else. Yes. Amen. Hey, amen. This was so cool. Yes. Hallelujah. Come on, guys. You can do better than that. You know. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. <laughs> yes. I. 
here in Tennessee, Jack Robinson. He said, I, will, I, I would like to be delivered by being lazy. I don't like to work. I don't like to to do anything. Mm-hmm. Uh, we, we, I, I don't like to work. I don't like to do anything. I just want to play video, vi, vi, video games. My goodness. He well, said he wants exactly. to be delivered from being lazy. Is okay. that is that, well, appli- well, is that applicable, Minister Brian? Being lazy can be delivered. Say that again. Is that applicable Hello? to be to uh, delivering a, a lazy person? No. Of course, mm-hmm. uh, yes. It's, of course, it's possible and biblical for someone being delivered from being lazy. That's that's stagnation. That's a blockage. That's a uh-huh, hindrance. Uh-huh. That, yes. That that needs to be moved out of the way. That video game. It's a yes. distraction. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Sometimes we gotta throw. A lot of times we gotta throw those video games away. Mm-hmm. We gotta throw it out because you do no. not want the video <laughs> game sitting there calling you. Okay. <laughs> okay. His name is Jack Jack Robinson. So, do you want to pray for him later or what is it? He said that I, yeah, I want to no. be delivered. He said I want to be wait, delivered wait, wait, being lazy. Jack Robinson. We're gonna pray. Name. We will. We will pray at the end, and I'm a good, I'm going to call out the spirit of laziness in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Yes. Uh, hallelujah. So we go now to Brazil. Brazil. Hello, Brazil. Sophia. He said, "Please pray for my mother, Bordelina, for ha- for battling from breast cancer." Brazil, Sofia, please pray for my mother, Bordelina, for uh, for struggling, battling, is in battling from from breast cancer. Did you get that, uh, Minister Brian? Yes, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pray right now, real quick. It's only gonna take like ten yes. seconds. Yes, yes, hallelujah. Father God, I come in agreement with Sister Sofia that her mother, Bordelina, that she yes. That the cancer will be will be removed in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I rebuke that cancer right now in the mighty name yes. of Jesus Christ. I take yes. that generation of curse from Sophia, from Zodalina, yes. yes. right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire, 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 Okay, before we go on, you, you better take advantage, Sister Mary Lou and Sister April. Do you have anybody that, that Brother Brian wants to pray over here? You better take advantage right now. <laughs> uh, Sister Mary Lou, do you, do you have anybody in particular, or if you don't want to say any names, do you have anyone that Brother Brian, that yes, you want you. Minister Brian yes, to pray yes, for? Yes, it? yes, yes. Hmm. Um, yeah, the, the people we're ministering to uh, that uh, <clears throat> have the have the live in their car for years, uh, you know, um, so they're trying to look for a job and uh, homeless. You know, so just to, they yeah they, they 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 are still on the lookout for jobs. So we are praying for favor from the Lord, and. Uh, and that's it, you know. Um, we're trying to help them out, but uh, uh, we can only do so much, you know. Uh, and and so I also need prayer for strength, you know, to continue with this work that the Lord had had uh, laid in my heart uh, for these people. Uh, yeah, but it's more it's more okay if you have particular name that you can mention. It's more it's more uh, effective, I think. You know, do you have any somebody else in particular name or you, you just want to... Oh, uh, all of them. Um, all of like them. It's like a group okay. of people that uh, we're ministering to, yes. You, so you're talking about uh, homeless people, right? Amen? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, yes. Uh, so do you want to pray for that now, Brother Brian, or you want to do it at the end of the show, before the end of the show? Yes, that's fine. I pray for real quick. Father okay. God, I come in agreement with, with your daughter here right now with the mic and name of Jesus Christ, Father God. Yes. We, we, we break the spirit of poverty from the people right now with the mighty name yes. of Jesus Christ. And the spirit of laziness right now yes. in yes. Jesus Christ's name. Jesus name. May yes. God be 
open for them, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Give your uh-huh. daughter strength to fight uh-huh. for your fight and supply her, Father God, yes. in your sight. Yes. Jesus Christ, mighty name. Amen. Amen. Yes. Hallelujah. And what about you, Sister April? Uh, do you want to pray? Do you want Minister Brian to pray for your mom, Sister Early? Sister April? Oh. Um, well, yeah, go ahead. Okay. Uh, uh, Sister, er- Sister Early Roland is her name. Uh, I think she just had a surgery. And um, what's, what's, what's the name of the sickness? A new reason? Is it a new reason? Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. You you want to pray for that now, Minister Brian, or no? Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll pray for it real quick. Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, healing for her mother right now with the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Yes. Any blockage that's in her body, I command yes. it to come up and out right now with the mighty name, name of yes. Jesus Christ. Father God, lead her to repentance. May she yes. read the Bible. May she yeah, seek hallelujah. for joy, Father God. May yes. she seek your face, Father God. Yes. May she seek you name. through your son, Jesus yes. Christ. Mighty name, amen. And I'm going to pray at the end. I'm going to pray at the end for everyone. All yes. Right? Yes. It's going to take care of everyone in one shot. All right? Yes, so the worldwide. The for the end. You, you pray the world at the end. In Mississippi, Don Richard. His name is Don mm-hmm. Richard. He said, I'm still struggling of porno, pornography. I. I want to be delivered, and and my mom prayed for me, but it, I I'm still unto it unto, unto pornography. Mississippi, Don Richard, you want to pray for that now or not yet? Bring it, bring it to us. Uh, uh, just read me what everyone's going through. I'm writing it down, and then yes. at the end, I'm gonna call it all out, and it's gonna help uh, yeah. to anyone yes. who's listening. So yeah, you can tell me what they're dealing with. So tell them, them, brother, don't worry about it. At the end, I'm going to pray for everyone's situation. Yes. It's going to be, yes. And it's going to be against poverty, sickness, pornography, everything else. So just yes. pray at the end and, and yes. watch the miracles happen in the mighty name yes. of Jesus Christ. And, and then, he's from Mississippi, Don Richard. Okay? Thanks. Don Richard. Uh, yeah. we, yes. Fine. Yes. United Kingdom. Joey, United Kingdom. He said Hello. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Joey. Yeah, Joey. It said that uh, I I'd li- I want to get rid of my marijuana habit of smoking. Okay. Okay. okay so uh, mm-hmm. I, yep. I I was I was prayed by my church also, but after three days, I I'm still craving for marijuana, and until now, I'm still smoking. I but I want to get delivered. <laughs> Joey, United Kingdom. Okay. Yes. Nigeria. Make, Joey, make sure. Okay, go, mm-hmm. ahead, go ahead, go ahead. No, go ahead, Br- Minister what? Brian. You, you want to say something to him? He's listening. Like, like, I, like I said, everyone, if you get, if you, if you ever receive deliverance, and if you see, the, if you receive deliverance after this, remember to maintain your deliverance. How? You must still continue to read the Bible. Just because mm-hmm. you ask God praying does not mean that you let go of the Bible. Mm-hmm. You yes. gotta continue mm-hmm. in your. You gotta continue walking mm-hmm. and living righteously. The mm-hmm. fight doesn't mm-hmm. stop. You can get delivered. You can get delivered. But guess what? The devil wants to come back in, and when they come yes. back, they will come back seven times worse. No. So oh no. Down. No. That's what the Bible says. He's, he's saying the truth. That's what the Bible says. They will come back. Okay, in Nigeria, Kalobi, he said, we, we are not being delivered because of our lust. It is the lust of the flesh that must die. Do you agree with that, yes. what he said? Yes, yes. Nigeria, Kalobi, he, must... he said that the lust of the flesh must die. Do you agree with that, Sister Mary Lou? Yes, because um, because the flesh does um, come. We have to thank God that there is a place of deliverance. And, mm-hmm. um, you know, we cannot see God when there is flesh in the way. Amen? Mm-hmm, because mm-hmm. God's Amen. face is hidden. God's face is mm-hmm. hidden when there is no holiness. When flesh is in the way. Because we need to operate in spirit so, so mm-hmm. that the lust of the flesh will die. Amen. <laughs> Do you agree with that? Let me ask something real quick. Now, yeah. 
we got to change the way we talk. We got to change the way we think. We got to change what we listen to. Are you still listening to worldly music? Mm -hmm. Are you still, are you still, um, are you still wearing a lot of makeup? We have to tone everything down. We got to be more (laughs) modest. We, we, we got we to gotta, we gotta tone it down a notch, amen? We, 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 need to, yes. we need to focus on pleasing God and amen. not pleasing men. Yes. But you focus. know what? Mm-hmm. Let's, let's please God. Yes. There is, there is one now on app that you can put a lot of makeup in your face and they change your face. <laughs> You become you become like Marilyn Monroe, or you can be like a, a, a young girl or something it's because of makeup. And that's an no, app. No. <laughs> and, 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 and men, men should men should not be wearing earrings. You oh, gotta tone it down. That's pride. <laughs> men wearing earrings. Yes, that's pride. <laughs> We need to cast out pride. We I, need I, to. I we, we, huh? Go ahead. No, no, no. I'm listening. I, I'm just saying. I don't know where where the uh, earring earring of men originated. You know, I don't understand that. Where the earring of men originated? You know. Yes. It 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 it, it came back from Egypt. Uh huh. The, the pharaoh. The pharaoh used to wear a lot of makeup. The pharaoh used to wear eyeliner. The pharaoh oh, used to wear earrings and wear jewelry. And mm-hmm. that's pride. And, uh-huh, and, and uh-huh. it becomes a hindrance. It becomes a hindrance. You know mm-hmm. why it's a hindrance? Because yes. now you don't have confidence in yourself. You have uh-huh. confidence in the jewelry. You have confidence mm-hmm. I'm wearing too much makeup. Now, uh-huh. the person who's wearing all of that don't think yes. they're good enough. Yes. What can you say about this? Um, what can you say about this uh, this uh, app? Because Sister Mary Lou is, uh, I want you to know, Sister Mary Lou knows how to put a good makeup. Sister Mary Lou right here. He, he, yes, she, yes. She works with Mary Kay. Yes, she <laughs> Yes, so what, yes. what, I was a fashion you, illustrator, but yes, I teach, yes. yeah, but I teach the I teach the women that the beauty inside is what we need to cultivate because uh-huh. our yes. eyes must be fixed on, on not on things that we see, but on things yes. that we do not see because everything is all temporary. No matter yes. how much makeup you put in there, we will all get old. What will you do yes. when one is old? I mean, we have yes. walk you know that. I mean, yes. it's just gonna be endless. So we need to uh, cultivate the thing of the, the beauty from inside. Uh, yes, yes. What Come what on. can you say, yes. Sister Mary Lou? What can you say about this um, <laughs> yeah. app app right now that they put on the uh, internet? The app you use app and then they can change your face. They can put a lot of makeup. What can uh, it's so it's so yeah. like a uh, artificial, you know? <laughs> it's so artificial. Yes, it does not you. Actually. It it actually breaks my heart to see women taking pictures of themselves, and it's exactly what the Bible says. In the last days, people will be lovers of themselves instead Mm -hmm. of lovers of God. And it is all of this uh, a natural thing, and it's actually not their real faith. So, yeah, it's not so again it's deviating <laughs> from the truth. What is the truth? What who who are you really? <laughs> yeah, it's, it's not the real face. Uh, okay, let Sister Angel no, is so quiet. Not. No, it's did not. you it's ever not. did you ever try this app, Sister April? Did you ever try this this beauty app uh, on uh, on on the internet or something like that, Sister April? Um, come on, no. Wake up. <laughs> <laughs> no. no, no, no. I don't. Um, yes, but uh, no, no. yes. But, uh, Sister April has a very uh, natural beauty. I admire that. Amen. You know, Amen. yeah. Na- natural beauty is is that's better. You know, very very good. Very good. Let the beauty from your heart shine out. Because let me tell you something. Mm-hmm. I seen beauty. I seen people that was beautiful in the outside, but their mm-hmm. heart, their soul was rotten. Mm-hmm. 
Uh oh. Right. Yeah. Uh oh. Mhm. Yep. Yeah. 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 Remember. Trying to make so look mm. better with a plastic surgery. Mm. Surgery? So, that, yeah. They have yeah, they have that uh, they're not con- yeah they're not contented about their looks they want to do a lipo li- a lipo surgery yeah, which is not their yeah. real nose <laughs> yes yes yeah, yeah. you know you know April my my nose is always flat and I, I'm happy with it my nose is always flat I have a flat nose you know so I'm happy with it you know so. Yeah, there are some people who are not who are not contented. What did you say? I'm sorry, you still talking? She she gets cut off. So. Mhm mhm. Yes. What? It is better to have a natural look. Right. I did hear what you said. Mhm. My okay. turn. Praise God. Okay, April, we'll go back to you. So we if we have now here from uh, we have 25 minutes on the show. And so the the, the time is the time is very very uh, very good. It's 25 minutes on the show. Singapore. His name is Ming or her name is Ming. He said I have five. He that is a he. I have five girlfriends and I just want them. Uh, I just have them for two to three months and get rid of them again and then get more other girlfriends. So. So far, I have eight girlfriends. Is this what you call uh, normal, or I'm, I'm, I need to be delivered having too much girlfriend? My, uh, <laughs> I <think laughs> did you, hey, did you see what you, what you said? Hey, <laughs> he, he, he knows what he's doing. He's playing with Hellfire. He better be very, very <laughs> careful and change real quick. God is you not to be mocked. Doing. God is not to be mocked. God is not uh-huh. a joke. You yes. better repent and you better be careful. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, Time mm-hmm. is up. Time is almost up. He's collecting girlfriends. He said that right now he has eight girlfriends. So do you think this needs to be delivered? That's, this needs to be, he needs to be delivered. Am I right? Am I right? But I don't know. Mr. Brian can answer you. His name is Ming from Singapore. Brother Brian. You better, listen, but listen, Jesus said to take one wife and for, for a woman to take one husband. Mm-hmm. No more than that. Mm-hmm. And, if but, you, uh, and if you have a girlfriend, turn her mm-hmm. into a wife. Amen. Amen. Yes, yes. He said girlfriends only, Minister Brian. He said girlfriends only. So, uh, Ming. So we have no from North Dakota. I hope he listens to what you said. North Dakota, Sam. He said, do you call marijuana? Okay, North Dakota, Sam. He said, do you call marijuana as as an addiction if being if it's being prescribed by the doctor? It works for me, but, but it is addictive. Uh, it's it's pharmacia is being used the wrong way. God does mm-hmm. not want you to smoke nothing. It destroys mm-hmm. the body. It destroys mm-hmm. the lungs. He mm-hmm. he Jesus let Jesus be the healer. Let the Holy Spirit be the healer. Not Amen. a substance. Not a, not alcohol. Not anything that's for the mind, not mm-hmm. anything that's going to get you high. You want to yes. get high, get high, get high of the Holy Spirit. Get high with the Holy Spirit. The Holy Amen. Spirit. Hallelujah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. Get high with the Holy Spirit, everybody. Come on. Yes. I don't know why, uh, <laughs> Dr. What can you say about this, Mr. Mary Lou? I want to hear from you. Why why do you think doctor uses marijuana as a prescription? It it says be, it, it is addictive. Are you do you agree to, to well, this uh, to this fellow uh, from North Dakota Slam? 
Well, you know, if, if, if the doctor are using it for professional use, uh, they have the right, they are, they are legally, legally, they can do it. But when mm-hmm. the people try to fool around with, with drugs and make addition out of it, they, they need to be delivered because mm-hmm, it, mm-hmm. It, is, it is not from God. If we say we want a, a purity in heart, then our body needs to be pure because it is the temple of God. So mm-hmm, we mm-hmm. have to give respect. We have to see, give respect to what we are thinking, what we are doing physically, mm-hmm. mentally, emotionally, and how uh-huh. we handle our lives. We have to be. We have to be asking uh, the Holy Spirit, you know, to to fill us like what the pastor said. We need to be yes. filled with the Holy Ghost so we don't sleep because this marijuana yes. will put you to sleep. And you wake yes. up, and it's the same thing all, all over again. It's the same thing yes. with drugs and alcohol and sex. Yes. It's all the same. We are flirting. Yes. We are flirting with the devil. That's what it is. Yes. So, so Minister Brian, do you think this uh, prescription that's going on around uh, our place, you know, all over the place now, the prescription of the doctor of having marijuana, whatever that is, it is a form of a tool of the devil to destroy uh, the lives of people? It's a distraction. Mm -hmm. It will keep you away from the Bible. It will make you lazy. It will keep you away from seeking the Lord. Mm -hmm. It's all set up. That's why it's that's why it's released now. Because Mm -hmm. it'll it'll make you numb. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Yes. 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 Yes, so what? So, but what's the best thing to do? That doctor prescri- prescribing it. This is some kind of like. <laughs> this is some kind of. Uh, this is a. Uh, this is a big, a huge thing, you know, which no one can stop it. I think we can just stop it through prayer. What do you think? Or you ask a the lot doctor of people to... get high. Mm-hmm. A lot of people get high because they're dealing with spiritual problems. They're dealing Hallelujah. with loneliness. Yes, yes. Yes. They're dealing with depression. They're dealing mm-hmm. with trauma. Yes. You, you can't mm-hmm. medicate that. It needs to be tossed it up mm-hmm. in Jesus' name. There needs Amen. to be a renewal of the mind. There needs yes. to be a change. There needs yes. to be repentance. It's yes. time to be mm-hmm. born again. again. It's time to be born again. That includes, he yes. mentioned it, that that includes drama, people. Drama. <laughs> Stay away from drama. Okay. So here you go. So uh, we move on. This one here on a. Uh, where am I here? I'm looking at my screen. Okay, Dubai. Ricky Manawes. Ricky Manawes in Dubai. He said, "I have a lot of anxiety because I'm far away from my family. I'm working here. Please pray for me." You get that, Minister Brian? Yes. Yes. What do you want he, me to pray for? He said he has a lot of anxiety because I'm far away from my family because I'm working here in Dubai. His name is Ricky Manawes. Please pray for me. Yes, he's dealing with loneliness. Yes, I'm going to pray yes. at the end all, for all of this. Okay, all of that. Okay, we have we have 20 minutes. The time is running so fast. Okay, guys, 30 minutes. Yes. <laughs> Okay, now here we go. Uh, okay, Mississippi uh, already. I'm in Texas. Alicia, she said, please pray for my boyfriend who is alcoholic and drug addict. Our relationship is not that good because of these habits that he has. Okay, get that? Texas, Alicia. Yes. Rhode Island. Yes. Do you want me to skip now? Rhode Island, New York. It's New York, Rhode yeah. Island, New York. Hello, New York. Yes. He said, his name is Tommy. Okay. Uh, what's this? Uh-huh. I, have, I, I, have, I have been delivered from, from gambling, but I, I still need a prayer because I gamble every day. Okay. Hallelujah. Is that me to be... Gambling, this time, Rhode Island, Tommy. Okay, not a problem. I'll be praying for that too as, as well at the end. Yes. And Australia, Australia right now. Her, 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 name is, her, her name is Becky. Please pray for me. I need to be delivered. Please pray for me. I need to be deliver, delivered from 
the smoking uh, already smoking smoking and gambling already lost thousands and thousands of dollars in casino i believe i am addicted to it gambling and smoking hey, hey listen i'm going to say something real quick yes if anyone is serious anyone that okay that's listening if they mm -hmm. are serious they want to give up smoking drinking whatever mm -hmm. it is before mm -hmm. I pray at the end, I want mm -hmm. you, I want you guys to throw out those cigarettes right now, to throw mm -hmm. out that vape machine, to throw out that alcohol. Don't leave yes. it there. Sit it in the house because guess what? Uh -huh. It's a, it's a ticking time bomb, and there's there are demons hiding in there. Throw it mm -hmm. out. Don't leave it there. Yes. It's, it's like it's, a it's, it's like a kid still hanging out in the candy shop. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Eventually, you you want to take a lick. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Yes. So get rid of it. Hallelujah. Be, be, before before. Yes, you get rid. You will get you will you will receive more deliverance if you throw it out right now. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Okay, so yeah, I think I don't see I don't see anything anymore. But here we go. Uh, uh, there, there's nothing wrong on the screen right now. Anyone has a, a, a request, uh, Sister Mary Lou? Sister Mary Lou, do you have any requests? Yes. Yes. Are you ready? Said about your ministry. Yes. How about you, Sister yes. April? Yes. Your mom read. So. You, I have I have a couple of questions um, here. Uh, so the hind you said that you mentioned Minister Brian that the 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 hindrance of deliverance is uh, the number one is is fear. Is it fear? Fear, mm -hmm. fear, mm -hmm. and fear, fear and doubt. Fear and doubt. The reason why it's fear mm -hmm. because fear fear when you have fear. And you you fear you fear the demons and you doubting the word of God. Uh huh. Believe uh -huh. what the Lord has told you. Believe mm -hmm. that if you serve Him, that you ask anything in His name, it shall be given. Amen. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And fear Amen. can block you because fear can block you because nobody doesn't want to nobody doesn't want to go against devils because they mm -hmm, think they're mm -hmm. going to lose. Uh -huh, but you got to yes. realize that the God you got to realize that the God that you serve is greater than them. Hallelujah. And you have authority, you, and, you, and you are given the authority. Know your authority. Yes. Luke, yes. Like again, Luke chapter 10, verse 19, you have the power to yes. temple on snakes and scorpions. Let me read another verse, too. Um, yes. When you ask, when you, when, Father God, he's a good God. If you mm -hmm. ask him for a fish, when mm -hmm. you ask him for a fish, he's not going to give you a snake. He's going to mm -hmm. give you a fish. So if you yes. ask for righteous things, if you ask him to remove the fear, it shall yes. be done. Amen. Shall be done. And come, Amen. And, and come, come against those devils that are in you. Come yes. against them. Read the mm -hmm. scriptures. Cast them yes. out. Cast every yes. of imagination. Renew yes. the mind. Change the way you yes. think. Change the way you walk. Change the way yes. you act. Change the way yes. you, you talk. Too. Yes. Everything has Hallelujah. to be We cannot be yes. lazy no more. No more, yes. no more lazy Christians. That's no it. more lazy Period. Christians. Yes. It's time to rise up. Yes. It's time to fight. Hallelujah. Okay, I have I have another mm -hmm. woman coming mm -hmm. on the screen. This time is from is from the is from the Philippines. Philippines, Christy. She said, yeah. "Me and my family are gathering here right now, listening to your radio program, Baby Sub." And we are thankful for your special guest today for deliverance. But I have a request. I'm from Olongapo City. My 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 father is in is is in California, and I would like to meet him. I have not seen him since birth. His name is James Johnson. Okay. Mm. Philippines, Father God, Father God, make a way for her to see her father, Father God. Make a way so your son yes. can be glorified, so they yes, could Lord. glorify your name for yes. answering their prayer, Father God. Yes. Make it happen for, for them in your son. 
Jesus Christ, mighty name, amen. And amen, yes. Hallelujah. Wow. Oh, wow. Yes, yes. So, uh, yes, so, so deliverance. Today, today's deliverance all over the world, those are countries. Let me just looking at the, the, the geography before we pray. Brother Brian is here today to pray, all, all of us guys, you know. Um, also, I, I would like you to continue. My, uh, my, my, my daughter who has uh, autism, uh, uh, Minister Brian, she has autism. Autism? Yes. Okay. It's, her name is Liberty. That's, that's Liberty. That's, that's her name, Liberty. Okay. Liberty. That's her name. Amen. Okay, so I'm okay. looking at your group. You, are you want to pray now, or you want to go ahead? Thank you, Jesus. No, no, no. We'll, we'll, we'll pray again. Don't worry about it. We're going to pray again. Okay. I'm a, I'm a yes. I, I, I'm just looking at the geography right now. The, the United States right now is we went up to 89.8%. Point, 89. Yes. Mm -hmm. It means... It means uh, the one that's listening right now is about 500,000 to 600,000 people in, uh, on different devices. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Uh, thank you for for thank you for everything, Lord. So we have United States. Now, if we're uh, looking at the geography right now, before before Brother Brian looking at it, South South Africa, North Africa, and Central Africa, it went up to 15.8 percent. 15.8 percent. Yes. Canada, Canada, 25%. India right now is 17%. France, Argentina, Italy, 15%. Colombia, 15%. Spain, Sweden, Singapore, 15%. Germany, Germany, London, London, and United Kingdom is 15%. Madagascar, 14%. Madagascar, Utopia, 10%. Uh, Australia, 25% listening. Philippines right now is 24%. 24%. Singapore is 22%. India right now is 17%. Bolivia is 10%. But, but USA right now is, is 89.80. Wow. 89.89%. USA, 89.89%. It's almost like 90%. Awesome. So I don't know how, how, how long is that. So uh, right now, where, whoever you are, wherever you are, I want you guys to be to be uh, uh, be still there, and, and you have to agree to the man of God here, uh, Minister Brian Malave. You have to agree with him with his prayer and whatever you request you have in thoughts or in in words in your heart, including. Including Sister Mary Lou is here and Sister April. If you have somebody in your thoughts that wants to be delivered from any bondages of Satan, uh, 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 let's all agree with the man of God here as we pray uh, for for worldwide. Here is a worldwide prayer, and um, uh, let me know, bro brother Brian. Here is a worldwide prayer from brother Brian. Let me know when you're ready. How <clears throat> I command the strong man to come up and out of the mouth right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Every witchcraft, every strong man come up and out of the mouth, out of the mouth, out of the mouth right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Holy Ghost, fire, 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 f
cancer, autism, diabetes. I command it to come up and out of the mouth, out of the mouth, out of the mouth right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Come out, loneliness, spirits of loneliness, trauma. I rebuke you. Come up and out of the mouth, out of the mouth, out of the mouth, out of the mouth, out of the mouth. Come up and out, up and out. Let's go. Every poison out, out of the belly, out of the chest. Out of the mouth. Come out, you stinks right now. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, enter up. I, I, I cancel every spirit, husbands and spirit wives. I divorce you from them in Jesus Christ's mighty name. Exit out of the mouth. Out of the mouth. Fire, fire, fire. Exit up and up, up and up. I bind you and I pull you out, strong man. Every strong man, I command you come up and out of the mouth. 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 Come out. Spirit of gambling. I cancel the spirit of gambling right now with the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Come out. Spirit of gambling. Smoking. Drinking. Pharmacia devils. I command you to come up and out of the mouth. Out of the mouth. Out of the mouth. Out of the mouth. Out. Come up and out of the mouth. I mean, people go shit to the pits of hell. In Jesus Christ's mighty name. Come out. Unforgiveness. Bitterness. Anger. Rage, I rebuke you right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Exit up, exit up, come out, witchcraft. I rebuke you right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Exit up, exit up, fire, 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 in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Come out, spirit of lust. Come up with any of them, any of them, any of them, right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Come out, spirit of addiction. I rebuke you right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Come out, spirit of loneliness. I command you come up with any of them, any of them, come out, come out mm-hmm. spirit of loneliness. Exit up. Exit up, 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 right now with the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father God, healing, healing in the heart, healing in the mind right now with the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Healing in the mind, healing in the heart right now with the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Come out, every blockage out, any hindrance out. You devils are trying to block my brothers and sisters from reading the Bible. I cancel your assignment right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Exit up. Healing, healing in the, in the private areas, healing in the heart. Come out hurt, come out pain. I rebuke you right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Exit up, exit up, exit up. Fire, 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 fire. In the mighty name of Jesus, all you devils come up and out of the mouth, out of the mouth, out of the mouth, out of the mouth right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Healing in the mind. Renew their minds, Father God. Renew their minds. Renew mm-hmm. their hearts. Renew their health. Renew their soul right now with the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire. Blessings all over their homes. Blessings in their finances. Blessings in their health, Father God. May they read the Bible. May they speak in tongues. May they cast mm-hmm. out devils in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. May they raise the dead. May they believe. I cast out the spirit of fear. And I cast out the spirit of doubt. Right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Exit up. Exit up. Come on, spirit of fear. Come on, spirit of doubt. Come on, Lord. Exit up. Exit up. Exit up. Exit up. Exit up. Exit up. I rebuke you. Go straight to the pits of hell. In Jesus Christ's mighty name. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Fill them up with healing. Fill them up with strength. Fill them up with healing. Fill them up with strength. Right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Fill them up with the blood of your son, Jesus Christ. Fill them up with the blood of the Lamb. And we thank you, Heavenly Father. Through your son, Jesus Christ, mighty name. Amen. 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 Yes. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. That was that was a, a very good prayer. Powerful. Sister, Sister Mary Lou, are you still there? Amen. Sister Mary Lou, are you still there? Sister April, are you still there? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Brother Brian, that was a very good uh, prayer. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. So you are open. You're open to call here at 845-277-9272. And if you have any testimony today, or if if you know anyone has been delivered, you are free to uh, to uh, give me a call or or write me write me on this show on uh, on blo- on on this radio show or text text up here on my episode you can uh, text those are out of country out of the united states you can text me and you can write me your comments and you can you can um you can put a request again or you can any kind of request or anyone that you want to be delivered you, brother, brother brian is still here we have five minutes of the show yeah. we want to thank you we want to thank you for uh, being here, but uh, you know, Brother Brian, uh, uh, Minister Brian Malabe, right here. So, so you said, 
you said that you have the website and the date of your activities, right? Right now? Yes, yes, yes. If you want to, yes, yeah, let me, um, I have it right now. Just hold on. Um, if people are in America, and if you feel like flying to America to so get some hands on deliverance, I'm going to give you the dates where I'm going to be at. And, uh, and, mm-hmm. and if you want to get a hold of me, just get in contact with Baby. And she'll mm-hmm. get a hold of me, and it, she'll, she'll put us together, so don't worry about it. But mm-hmm. let me give you the address where I'm going to be at. In America, in New Jersey, June 5th, mm-hmm. I'll be at the Holiday Inn in New mm-hmm. Jersey in Frontage Roads, in Frontage Roads, Newark, New Jersey. So if you, if you would like to go, let Baby know, and she will mm-hmm. contact me, and we can make it happen in Jesus Christ's mighty name. If you were Amen. to find yeah. me... You can find me on YouTube. You mm-hmm. can find me on Facebook. You can find me on TikTok. My name uh-huh. is Brian CP Malave. Is there a ticket so, of that? I'm um, not too hard that, to find, guys. Uh, uh, is there a ticket on that um, event, Brother Brian? The New oh, Jersey. Is there a ticket? Is there a ticket? Do you? No, is no, it, it's, is, it's for free. Just, just come. Just show up it's and free. Come, that's all. It's free. It's free. Yes. Okay, guys. Yes. It's free. The, we're, uh, it's on, um, I, I will write it down anyway. At the end of this show, you guys can uh, click the replay of this of this uh, show. You can click the replay and uh, before the end of the show. And again, I, wa- I want to thank for all of you who are here today. I want to thank April. Thank you for, for being here once again. April. Mr. April. Thank you. Yeah. You, thank you for being here. You okay? Thank you for having yes. me. Yes. Uh, how was your cruise? How was your cruise? Oh, uh, when? Did, did you have a cruise last 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 month only? Are you having a hard time with your microphone? Okay, Sister Mary Lou. Sister Mary Lou. <laughs> well, thank you for being here. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for being here today. Do you have anything to, uh, to so tell to the audience? Ministry. Thank you for your mm-hmm. faithful. Yeah, you're faithful yes. in your ministry. Thank you, Minister Amen. Sabrina. Hallelujah. And Amen. Minister and Minister Brian Malabe is right here. We want to thank him for being here. Not a problem. Hallelujah. Not a problem. Hallelujah. Any, anybody? Anybody wants one-on-one delivery, just get a hold of baby, and she'll get a hold of me, and I will help you in Jesus' name. Yes. Many, many have been uh, testified about this ministry that th- there are many individuals who got delivered from any kind of oppression of the devil and bandages, and um, that was a good ministry. Hallelujah. Okay. We want to thank for the sponsor of the show, Self Jewelry. Self Jewelry, Planet Fitness, Oda Zone. They're all like uh, less than a year. Wendy's Hamburger, ADT Security Alarm System, Dish Network. We want to thank you. Uh, go to alwayslandflowers.com. That's my. Before I go there, Sonic. I want to thank you for sponsoring the show. Del Taco. We want to thank you for sponsoring the show. And of course, Senior Life Insurance. My endorser, www.gotoalwaysnetflowers.com. Again, www.gotoalwaysnetflowers.com, 1-888-720-8221. If you want to be sponsored of the show, Baby Set Show, P.O. Box 40921, Bakersfield, California, 93384. Again, Baby Set Show, uh, P.O. Box 40921, Bakersfield, California, 93384. As a... As Minister Brian said, if you want to have one-to-one uh, deliverance, just uh, get in touch with me, so I can I can I can forward that to you, and uh, you'll be able Amen. to get in touch. You, you'll be able to get in touch with him. So uh, again, uh, it's not it's, it's still the same. The 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 audience right now, United, this is eighty-nine point eighty-nine percent, eighty-nine point eighty-nine percent still, and. Also, I'm giving up a free praise and worship CD. Please let me know. 
pretty shirt that David said. I'm giving that to you. Let me know what size you're wearing. Um, giving free praise and worship CDs and and of course uh, I, I still have my miracle pen. If you want to purchase it, it's only thirty five dollars free shipping. Came uh, made from Israel. I want to thank those who patronized my metro my miracle pen. Uh, I, I, I thank you for that profit, <laughs> new profit, and also that. Um, I said free T-shirt and also also my uh, baby said perfume is out in the uh, selected selected mall up here in uh, California April. If you come go to the go to the uh, perfume store right there. Uh, the perfume baby said is right there. Um, um, yes, hold on, one minute. Yes. Hold on. Baby said perfume. Well, so we're gonna gonna... Thank you so much for everything today, uh-huh. and we we bring we bring you right now the. The, our featured song artist, who is Carmen, being delivered. Thank you so much. Do you have any last thoughts, Minister Brian, before I let you go? Any last thoughts, sir? Any last thoughts? <laughs> Minister Brian, are you still there? Yes, yes, I'm here. Yes, go ahead. Do you have any last um, thoughts okay. to the audience? Be- I'm on the radio show. Hold on. Do you have do you have any last thoughts to tell to to the audience? Uh, look, well, God bless everyone in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you for having me on this radio show. And um, like I like like Sister Baby said, just uh, if you want to contact me, get a hold of her, or you could email me at cp dot christpassion at gmail dot com. And it's for free. I'm not going to charge you guys. It's for free in Jesus' name. Yes. Freely give and freely deceive. Amen? Amen. Minister S- Brian Sleepy uh, Malabi, ladies and yeah. gentlemen. So, Sister Mary Lou. Sister Mary Lou Chican and yes. April Hunt on the show. God bless you. Good evening. Good evening, America. Amen. Good evening. You, good, good evening, America. Good morning, yeah. Asia. Amen. Good morning, God Europe. Bless you, God bless you from America. Good, in Jesus' good, name. Good morning, Africa. Amen. Yes. <laughs> Hallelujah. I thank you, Lord Jesus. And your sermon on the song Delivered. Hallelujah. Let's enjoy the music.
worship it tonight.